what is up guys welcome back to another video and inside of today's video we are going to be covering the basics of map making and i am going to be making a map like real time just i'm showing you how you can make a map so yeah and also um brawl talk is dropping tomorrow like i i don't even know what's going to come in it sure it's going to be like exciting content but anyways let's hop right to the video so now we are going to be using brawlcraft to create our maps just trying out brawlcraft you know cuz um I might as well like make more maps on brawlcraft since like it's available on Android and I can use it on my um, laptop so first of all we gotta make a new map cuz we gotta start from scratch and I like to use that I like to create maps for like the game modes I play the most because I have a better understanding of like what that you know which bars would be good or like um, what playstyle would you want to play so I play Brawl Ball the most so um, you want to get Brawl Ball here and now you want to select your environment um, preferably for Brawl Ball you know, I could just um, get through a lot of these but Brawl Ball you will either want to select the Reno or Grassy Fields I, I prefer Grassy Fields because it's more simplish and map size it's 21 by 33 that's um the width of your map and name your map so you want to have like a map so what I like to do for like naming maps is that I just search on a dictionary just finding some words that fit your um theme so here it's like kind of soccer theme so you know i'm gonna like go with um beautiful game because i mean ball ball it's it's a game so beautiful game okay come on okay um so yeah beautiful game now let's create the map and first of all i'm right here you can see the map so have like these um lines have like these grids right here which really helps if you make a map but if you're going to like take a screenshot of your map just don't put it because it's like way better yeah so what i like to do is that i first of all i make sure i make sure i have diagonal mirroring on because that's where most of the maps um will be played um it's diagonal mirroring there's some exceptions like triple dribble but you know, it's just an exception and for brawl ball you want to use the right block so um no cacti no these kind of blocks so no stone blocks no cacti no skulls no power cubes no jump pads in brawl ball no um benches and no tnt and no none of that no spring char uh no jump pads too <coughs> so this means that you're limited to like rope fences um which i don't know if they can be used in brawl ball yet they probably can but um yeah so you want to have the right block variety and now you can zoom okay so first of all what i like to do is that i want to start in the middle and for the middle um no yeah so for the middle i kind of want like a middle where you could um get the ball like really fast so what i like to do is that um i just go with some few, okay, um yeah i go with a few blocks right here and preferably you don't really want to make your map um symmetrical like four quadrants equal so you want to have like this because um if you make your map have four equal quadrants it just makes your map like um play less well uh no, it doesn't play less well it's just like less original in my opinion and yeah so first of all um not second of all uh, actually second of all i want like people to Sneak in really easy ball. 
so I'm just gonna do the patch up there. And then, um, getting some aesthetics. Um, I'm going to have some more, um, some barrels around the crates, like here. And yeah, so it's like somewhat easy. Um, it's also hard to get the ball. Also, um, just for, for better purposes, like, it's gonna demonstrate some. Okay, so. Yeah. So basically, this is going to be my center. It's like it's somewhat easy to um get the ball, but um you know, keep aware of sharpshooters. And also, um, these are three distinct lanes. Like here, you can see three distinct lanes. So um, lane one is on the left, lane two is on the right. And I don't really need to explain that at all. But you want to have make your map have some kind of flames and also um just really quick you don't want to have one tile gaps or, or OTGs in your map because it makes your map like look bad and it also like um doesn't fit well like okay um so see here Basically, this is a one point gap you want to avoid. So here, marked in um, in the next formation mark. So what you want to hear is that you just want to remove it, and now you want to like get some other tools. So I like to I like to um, get these in because this like enforces some um, sniping moves. And okay, so yeah. Also for the mid, I kind of like the mid this way. But if you want to, like, you can just add a few more blocks, and for like aesthetic purposes, you can also um, get a, a barrel in. That's basically how I choose my map. So basically, the mid is pretty much done. You can like add some um, more grass here, but. I just recommend like doing these because that side is already um the enemy side is already like really um it's already finished so you don't want to like get some more on uh, get some more blocks on that side so what I like to do is that that and add my fence in and yeah, that um that creates good gameplay. Actually, th I don't know if that creates like good gameplay, but um yeah. Also, you want to focus on the gameplay first, then aesthetic. So aesthetically, this looks um pretty good, but gameplay wise, um I'm kind of worried like on the left side, so. Maybe I'm just gonna remove this from the And then I'm just gonna replace it with some other blocks here, so yeah. Okay, um, yeah, so basically I'm just gonna go ahead and um, link this bush to the other bush and here I'm just gonna make some sides, and um, I, what I like to do is that I just like to link a wall from one bush to another bush, and this is what I talked about um chaining, chaining figures. So you know, they're not that illegal. <laughs> Actually, they're, they're pretty good, but okay, so. I just completed that and also I kind of found some bushes here so what I like to do is that you cannot do it. what I like to do is that I just like to experiment with a lot of block placements and also all of these ideas just come um, in my head so I, I have like no I did not plan for this like it's just 
some mask blocks being together. And here for the cool area, you want to have like either this type of cool. So yeah. This type of goal, um, it's pretty easy to score, or you can just, um, I guess, remove like, one block on each side. Makes it like a bit harder to score. I guess it's a bit easier because um, the sides are a bit more open, and here, um, yeah. Here we got the sides, so I guess we could can do that. Can just put it right here. Okay. I guess like two blocks, two crates is like better than one for the one for all. And yeah, so paint tool you got that, and. Also, like, you got, like, kind of a spot to corner your ball, which I, I don't really like in Brawl Ball, like, it creates a stalemate game, but, like, the area, it's, um, it's really wide compared to, um, like, Super Stadium, which cornering the ball is, like, your, your way to go, so, maybe just to avoid that, I, um, I'd consider, like, um, just get getting rid of that get rid of that block and go for it. so this um it's a bit better and if you want to fill your sides just don't fill it with okay um that that was by accident if you want to fill your sides don't just um fill it by accident like here if everything's good if you think it's good like here it's actually really good sides so you don't need to um fix it but um if it's like bad if it's like actually really bad um then you gotta fix it and this is like a pretty good problem map um let's just save it and yeah So um, basically, I'm pretty sure I respected all of the fundamentals of map making. So no one tile gaps. One tile gaps um, will be um, highlighted in red. Uh, no, it's ex exclamation marks. And okay, so gameplay it's like not that bad. It may be questionable, but I guess it's um pretty good, in my opinion. And yeah, and also I used like I used a great vari variation of chain blocks and like these types of um structures like they're really fun to create. You can just imagine it. I don't know who created it, but I did it like on a few maps, and it just feels really good. And yeah, so let's just maybe um test out the map with some um, cold so okay it's not really testing it's just like uh, not shooting the ball but you can shoot you can shoot the ball with your um pistol didn't know that but um there's like no um, brawl command here because i don't know because we just probably has to fix the ball when the ball is gone. So here you have like somewhat good passing. Um, yeah, you have somewhat good passing. So basically, forces you to choose a lane right here. And that's better right here. So what I like to do is that this lane has a much bigger advantage than let's say this lane because this lane doesn't have like as many um defense blocks you have these blocks but um the other lane like this left lane has this big block and this um three by one block that you can defend 
Plus, um, if you get to control, you can also use these blocks to shoot. Which, um, okay, so also in the mid. Like right here. And then, um, on the sides, it's really just really open. Didn't really put much into the map, but, you know, I guess you want to make the some sides open because you know the mid is pretty congested and um so yeah just create really original maps um don't just i guess you can like maybe um okay, um maybe you can um what's the word already it's It's like you take an idea of other people like No, you you inspire. Okay, that's the word you inspire. You inspired some one's map and you just make some parts of the map there but don't make it all like and also don't make like um that part of the map super obvious so let's say you want to okay um so then it um okay, oh, didn't know that actually ended but um what was that? what was that so oh yeah um so if you want to like let's say inspire yourself from some parts of the map don't make it like super obvious just copy a bit of that map or you can like copy some wall cards, but you know, my wall cards aren't really that good. They're like pretty original. Actually, okay, the ball just got stuck right there. So I'm um, pretty sure that this is these um this structure and this structure are the only pretty original structures on the map. So once you have a few of these structures, like make your structures original and yeah and also on. okay so this side for my map this side does not have any bushes and um this is like a really good spawn really good um goal shot so you can bounce shots right here you can also um, trick shot right here and the ball bounces right here or you can just trick shot right here on this box um though like you need to be careful and yeah that's pretty much the map itself i hope you enjoyed the video like th this is like the map as a whole i hope you enjoyed the video but as again if you want another one of these for like another game mode Comment down below with your um, game mode suggestion, I guess. But yeah, that is going to be it. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in another video. Peace out.